Okay, let's see. Let's go again. So, clicky. I think D4 has been doing okay today. That sort of uh, F3 surprise against everyone's been raving about this move. So, uh, play E4 house CD. I think E4 would be more unusual. To get away from the uh, Groomfield paths, this looks cozy for the centre. So knight e2, bishop e3. D5. D5. I wonder about e6. I think I'll play d5 anyway. Maybe f4 now that I've gone in for this. Uh, I'm getting a bit loose. Uh, otherwise, knight e5. And if knight e2, knight e5, bishop e3, it's got c4. Then uh, bishop c2. Oh, let his knight come to e5. Come on. Or b6. I won't allow b5 though that easily. I want to secure this position, connect the rooks, centralize all the bits, then think about an attack. So something like castles, bishop g5, queen d2, rook c1, maybe the other one to d1, then bishop h6 after. Think about an attack after that. Although knight e5 does look like a pain. A5 free of charge, queen b4, rook a4. Traps the queen, doesn't it? Right here, another move free of charge, bishop f4. Looks useful anyway. Gives me queen d2, I'll exchange off these bishops. Right, there's no d6 or anything. Uh, Queen b3, just keeping the pin. There's no knight f3 for the moment. Queen b6, queen b3, knight a4 to b6, maybe. There's knight h5, bishop e3. If I take on e5, play knight b6, attacks the rook. Um. I think Queen B3, okay, Queen B3 to start off with. Okay, okay. Now Knight A4, is that any good for Knight B6? Oh, it's going to give me that Knight Square Bishop. Hmm, I'll just rook c1 then, or rook here, this one, just go that c5, c5 pawn looks a bit vulnerable. So knight a4 takes queen a4, potentially on c5, and knight a4, queen a5, knight c5. Mind you, potentially on b2. Gotta be careful about b2. Take with this one. Keep an eye on b2 with my queen. That knight g3 laying double pawns. Just to get bishop f1 in. Can't get an attack on c5 very easily. So knight. I don't know, knight g3. Bishop f1. It might be c4. Queen a3 there. Oh, knight g3 to the 
double pawns. No, they're going to be a liability. Queen b7 is possible. Weakness to the last move. Not to be uh, sniffed up too much. On a6, he takes on c4, but um, I don't know what's the queen doing? Maybe bishop c5 stuff. Queen a7, rook a8, queen b6. Alright, I'm going to go for the weakness of the last move. I'll trust in that. I hope that was a blunder. Not queen trap. Rook b8, queen a6. Knight c4, rook c4, rook b8, queen a7. If rook a8, queen b6. Protecting b2 at the moment. You can get b2 back. There's also queen c6. Just try and get the queens off and win c5. Queen c6. Ah, oh, okay. I don't want to win c5 like that. I mean, don't want to. Can't play queen d6 like that. Rather. <clears throat> This knight's a bit of pain. What about rook c2 for a moment? Hmm. Is bishop c5 still on the cards at some point? Right here. Uh, what a horrible thing to do to me is offering that queen or coming down here. Um, he takes check. And then rook c1, I seem to be falling to bits. About g4 to play knight g3. If I can play knight g3. G2 square as well for my king. So check king g2. That might solve a problem g4. He plays knight f6. Bishop f4 to force him to get the queens off. And I guess that structure is not repaired. So bishop f4 looks juicy after knight f6. He plays a check king g2. Doesn't seem a big deal. Bishop e5. No, I think I will. Take the queen off. Okay, bishop f. No, there's no bishop e5. Bishop f4 now. Yes. Okay. I'll crash through here. I'll just take to keep my rook on the seventh. Otherwise, rook b2 again annoying. So I'm fronting rook c8. He's speeded up. I've got to speed up. Almost in pre-move. I don't want to be less than 30 seconds in this game. Mess it up. So Queen C8 coming up. Um, or not. Okay, Queen C7. Just keep hold of A5. Hmm. Bishop c7, is that any good? I was on g1 potentially. Whoa! Let's get rid of this rook. Nope. It's got rook b2. Why is it going off of that? 18 seconds to finish me off. Why, is, he's, why am I saying that? He's in the worst position <laughs> for a change. <laughs> Bishop c7, bishop b6, just dominate the queen here. Checkmate the queen with queen c7, queen a7. <sighs> Nearly checkmating the queen, knight c6. Oh. I don't know, anything? Get knight f5 in, knight e6. Get to his king, knight d8. Okay. Yeah, I don't know, that's sort of. Phew. 
I don't know, complex game at the end. Um, trying to shut down counterplay. G4 might have helped here, unusually. Gives me G2 for the king. Um, trying to get his queens off. Comments or questions on YouTube? Thanks very much.